Three Little Pigs. Once upon a time, there were three little pigs who lived in a fine house with their mother. One day, she decided it was time for them to go out into the world. The pigs were very excited and promised to visit their mother often. Before they left, she warned them about the big, bad wolf. The wolf would watch them at every step of the way, because he would love to eat them all up if he had the chance. Before they had gone very far, they decided to have a picnic. As they were eating, a farmer walked by with a cart full of straw. That straw would be perfect to build a house with, said the first little pig, who was very lazy. It would be easy and very quick. He bought the whole cartful there and then. And the two other little pigs went on their way. The first little pig really just wanted to sleep and play. He built his straw house very quickly and was finished by lunchtime. He went inside to rest and fell asleep. He was woken by the sound of a deep, gruff voice outside. Who's there? called the first little pig. It's the big bad wolf, said the big bad wolf. And if you don't let me in, I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down. You can't come in, said the first little pig. My mother warned me about you. So the wolf huffed and he puffed, and he blew the house as far as the next town. The first little pig managed to escape and ran to find the other two little pigs. Meanwhile, the second and third little pigs came across an old woman carrying a load of sticks.
Those sticks would be perfect to build a house with, said the second little pig, who was a little bit lazy. He bought the bundle there and then. The third little pig carried on. The second little pig also just wanted to sleep and play. He built his stick house quickly and was finished just after lunchtime. He went inside to rest and fell asleep. He was woken by the sound of a deep, gruff voice outside. Who's there? called the second little pig. It's the big bad wolf said the big bad wolf. And if you don't let me in, I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down. You can't come in, said the second little pig. My mother warned me about you. So the wolf huffed, and he puffed, and he blew the house to the end of the next field. But the second little pig managed to escape, and he ran to find the others. Meanwhile, the third little pig came across a man with a wheelbarrow full of bricks. Those bricks will be perfect to build a house with, said the third little pig. They will be strong and safe. A strong house is worth spending time on. She bought the whole load there and then. The third little pig worked very hard and it took all day to build her fine brick house. She went inside to rest and fell asleep but she was woken by noises coming from outside. Who's there? called the third little pig. Don't worry, said the third little pig. Let's shut all the windows, lock all the doors, and light the fire. I've got a plan. Soon they heard the big bad wolf knocking on the door. It's the big bad hungry wolf, said the big bad hungry wolf. And if you don't let me in, I'll huff and I'll puff, and I'll blow your house down. 
You can't come in, said all three little pigs. Our mother warned us about you. Go away. So the wolf huffed, and he puffed, and he blew. The dust flew, and the leaves blew away, but the house did not move one bit. The wolf huffed, and he puffed, and he blew again. The trees bent, and the windows rattled, but the house did not move one bit. He huffed again, and he puffed again, and he blew again. The clouds skidded away, and slates were blown off roofs in the town. But the house still did not move one bit. That's it, shouted the wolf. I'm coming down the chimney. Here I come, he shouted. Watch out below. And he slid head first down the chimney. Straight into the pot of boiling water the three little pigs had put on the fire. He won't be, be a problem, problem anymore. Sang the three little pigs. Tomorrow we'll build two more houses, and this time we'll make them both out of bricks.